D do you like a film that makes you cry, or is that something you'd seek, seek out? Well, I have a confession to make, but I'm gonna, it's going to come good at the end. <laughs> I hope so. Don't worry. It's it funny, funny that thing, isn't it? When you see a film that's, off, we think, oh, that's a real guy film. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And give us some insight into what, what happens when, when you're maybe asked to watch a film that's more of a. Girl. Thing. Yeah. Well, what happened was thing. the other night, my lovely wife said to me, "Oh, we should watch P.S. I Love You," and I went, <laughs> "What?" <laughs> just the title. Just uh, I said, oh, "This is my worst nightmare." You know, can we watch? I don't know a Robert De Niro movie. She, she was like, "Who's Robert De Niro?" But that's another story. <laughs> anyway. And uh, she said, oh, come on, let's watch it. And I did the usual uh, sitting there going, OK, yeah, no worries. Yeah, of course, honey, no worries. And I'm sitting there going, I can't wait for this to be over. Did you also think if I watch this, what yep. sounds like a romantic film, we might get a bit Well, no, not at all. <laughs> anyway, halfway through, halfway through, not even halfway through, I was gone. You were crying. I was... I needed... I, on, honestly, those tissues, that Kleenex box, yeah. I was in... I was an absolute mess. And then I was angry that she made me watch it and I realised that all these years I've just been scared to watch. In case you cry? Yeah, maybe. Oh. <laughs> oh. It didn't come good at the end, were Craig, you, but... Were you cross with her for making you watch? No, she opened up a nice side of me. Oh, <laughs> did she? Is that true, Emily? So, 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 did the, so did the evening end in the way that you hoped well, it Well, you see, I think... This is what... I, don't worry, I'm going to be very respectful here, cos your dad's a surgeon. Can we just say Emily's in the audience? Yes, she is Emily's watching you with hawk-like eyes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, no, I, I think, too, sometimes guys think, actually, we'll go to this... Yeah, we'll watch one of those movies, cos it might, you know, lead to a bit of romance, because... You know, you're, they, they want to watch it, so they're going to so get happy. So they're feeling all snuggly. Yeah, it doesn't happen. Did it not work? No. OK. <laughs> is, what, is that true? <clears throat> what wasn't true is he did cry about one minute in. I did not. Halfway is not true. <laughs> <laughs> one minute. It's a really it? sad film. <laughs> <laughs> one minute in. Do you You notice? need to man Crap. up. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> It's an embarrassment. Do you notice that women exaggerate a lot? <laughs> it was it was definitely about near the end. Don't, don't you ever cry at film? No, no. Uh, those sort of uh, stories bore me, <laughs> senseless, darling. Not that I'm heartless and cold. I just prefer horror movies, really. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> Yeah. And Whittacombe, but darling. But do you, do you, uh, do you, <laughs> that reduces you to tears, doesn't yeah, it? Okay. Do you, do you argue with your partner? Has your partner got very different uh, tastes? No, we have really similar tastes, uh -huh. as a matter of fact. We very rarely watch romance flicks. Mm. You know, the yeah. flicks that I like, the gym made me cry, Sophie's Choice, those yeah. sort of real-life dramas, mm. you know, where you do have to make a choice. Yeah. Uh, I, I love those, and that, that's the only time I really sort of get sucked into a movie. You know, what about, you know, Goodwill Hunting, the Dead Poet Society, all those sort mm. of things? They're not necessarily chick flicks that, that you know, they make anybody yeah, cry. What about yeah. those sort of films? No, no, they didn't make me cry. I just thought they were intelligent, wonderful films. Yeah, I didn't cry. So, were you still in the mood for romance? <laughs> I'm, I'm sticking with this one, aren't you? Yeah. Were you still in the mood for romance after you'd sobbed and everything through this I film? I didn't. Well, it wasn't sobbing. You know, I just had a <laughs> slight <laughs> hay fever <laughs> tear. <laughs> uh, maybe I've uh, admitted too much. Yeah, there um, is a lady in the audience disagreeing with you. <laughs> yes. The lady that was sat right next she to you. She was there. Well, listen, it's just all a matter of opinion. Um, uh, <laughs> we, uh, we, we had a wonderful evening. OK. Yes. All right. Um, now, uh, we've got Cammy is obviously in our gallery, um, keeping an eye on proceedings. Now, obviously, Cammy. You and Peter know each other, don't we you? We do indeed, yeah. He's a wuss, I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> we did give a pet a home together and we castrated two dogs we and did. he wouldn't do the incision. I had to do it both times. <laughs> because, I'm, I'm sorry to go on about it, but when you're actually doing it, as yeah. a guy, you feel the pain. <laughs> As you're, it was. I can't. I couldn't do it. So circumcision that. films. That makes you cry. Never mind. A, never mind a romance. Okay. Circumcision films. So, Cammy, what are people thinking? Uh, oh yeah. There's lots of great comments here. There's only three times it's right for a man to cry. Says Darren. His mother dying. I'm with him on that one. His baby being born. I'm with him on that one. My two sons, Ben and Jack. I was there. <laughs> and when his favourite sportsman retires. I'm not sure about that one. Okay. Dave says all my wife's films make me cry. Yes. I cry because she asked me to watch them. <laughs> I cry all the way through, and I cry with happiness when it's over. 